Episode 75, Robot. Pressing play on part one, and now. And it's starting to play now. <laughs> <laughs> wow, that, that took forever for the disc to load. That took a hot second. It's also really quiet. I don't know how quiet it is for you. I mean, I have volume changers. There he is. Just tell me if it is too quiet and I'll try and turn it up some way. I mean, I can, I'll figure it out. I'm good for now. Just put subtitles on and you're fine. Oh, well. Wait. Okay. Never mind. <sighs> What? I was like, what the fuck is happening? Did we miss an episode? Oh no, they start they start immediately where they finished. Quick, call a doctor! Call a doctor. The doctor's in trouble. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Okay. Quick, call a doctor. He's being stupid, but also not. Yes, I know, but who is he taking? Give him a big old smooch. Time for it to not be- oh my fucking god. Oh no. Mhm. Mm yeah. Closed caption settings. Is... Let's shut up. Mhm. Hi, Chiriki. Mm-hmm. Wow. That's a that's a that's how you know the, the robot's evil. Chalk another one up for does the dog die? It probably, I mean, it, this is probably in, though. It's Pac-Man! Wait. Waka waka, everything's <laughs> Pac-Man, dear. You gotta remember that. Is that a washer? And dryer? No, it's a robot. Oh, it's a safe. <laughs> Clearly it's not that safe. <laughs> 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 That's, Man, I wonder what that's, he stole. <laughs> that's one of my favorite things is when things are like obviously labeled and it's so fucking dumb. Because I also I hate love it. it. Too. It's it's like the bag of money for a robber that has like the dollar sign yeah, yeah, on yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, exactly. That's exactly what it is. It's like <sighs> robber with like dollar sign on a sack. Mm hmm. No shit. Oh, yes, please. Uh huh. Okay. <laughs> Yeah. 
I'm trying <laughs> I'm trying to think of the term. I guess it would just be like obviously labeled things. Obviously labeled things, yeah. Yeah. Is this a fucking Monty Python skit? <laughs> it just broke a brick. Uh huh. Oh, I'm ugly. Are you saying John Pertwee had a terrible nose? <laughs> uh huh. <laughs> hashtag hashtag mother it's the representing singing Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I'm still kind of upside down. Please. <laughs> mhm. Mm Like, it would be <laughs> comical in the sense of, like, he opens up a box that says, like, wire cutters or something to yeah. get through a fence. Yeah. Or, like, uh, a, um, uh, a, a comically large, like, red stick of dynamite type deal. Yes. Or like the wooden box that obviously says TNT on it and there's nothing in there legitimately. There's no way. Help. 
Help. Help. Ah! Well, I guess it's fine. Oh, where are the top secret tools? Found him. Get the fuck we back love in a there. time lord high on regeneration energy. Get the fuck back in there. Oh, back. he is Pugliacci. Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> this sad clown. Look down, walk away. They left all the stuff labeled top secret behind. No, it's not labeled top secret. That's why they didn't know. <laughs> hello, hello. Uh, that's a miss? No, that's a camera. Oh, right, Sarah. Forgot about her for a second. Uh-huh. Feminism. It's not as... Here's the thing. That scene I, I really like, it's not as bad as, like, you know, Sarah explaining why women's rights is a needy thing. No, I know. It's, that's all it is. Just that short little scene. <laughs> Love. Hmm. 
Every man, give him a blanket. <laughs> By George, I want every man to have a blanket. Whether they're cold or not. Jesus Christ, Sarah, those heels. <sighs> yeah, those boots do not match her dress. Her dress doesn't match her dress. Oh, come on. Hmm. <laughs> he now is trying to summon Jesus. Ah, yes, the door marked do not enter. Mm hmm. It was positively no admittance, but sure. And in the casket is a house, is a house, mm -hmm. is a house. In the casket is a house, is a house. <laughs> the uh, feet up were a nice touch as it did sink uh, ass last. Yep. <laughs> mhm. Oh, that scarf's gonna get absolutely caught on everything, isn't it? It does, and it's great when it does. Uh-huh. Well, they're all dead. Hope you're happy. Nope. I can't find a pulse. Hello, I'm the cat. Meow. 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 Do you think he's a scientist? Nah. Mm. Good day.
Uh huh. Is that your version of a cigarette there, buddy? This is becoming more and more of a kid show. Not from not from that, but like the comical top secret stuff, among other things. Among Us? Yes. Well, it kind of makes sense with this one, because it's... This isn't really the start of the fourth Doctor's era, because this is still made by the people who were doing the third Doctor's era. Because this was made at the same time as the last episode. Hmm. Uh huh. That's how big a boy. How are you running in those? Sarah, please, wear less ridiculous boots. You literally almost just fell. Please. Positively no admit- you can tell it's in Britain. Because it says positively no admittance. Mm-hmm. Oh mm. my god. <laughs> well, Sarah's dead. Yep. Banana. Manamana 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 Hitting play on part two now. And the episode is playing now. <laughs> Wow, it, it takes a few seconds for the disc to load, huh? Yeah. I'm sure that's fine and not at all a problem. Yeah, I'm sure it doesn't make it really hard to sync up the commentary. Who are you, dear? Why are you here? Mm 
Mm. My god, it's furries! Furries are doing it! It's not a robot, it's just a guy in a giant fursuit. <laughs> Would you like some tea? Uh huh. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. And now, like every good journalist, you're going to die. You aren't fascists, are you? Uh-huh. Kill her. Kill her. Oh, he's watched Star Trek. Uh-huh. Oh, so it can't be that robot. Yeah. It's just a prank. Get over it, Sarah. It's just a prank. It was a social experiment. Mm-hmm. Touch its nipples. Caress its nipples. Very pointy nipples. 
In order to deactivate its ethical subroutines, turn its nipple clockwise. Bundle its balls, Sarah. Don't go into Chobits, I swear to fuck. <laughs> Jesus Christ. You know what happens in Chobits, yeah? I have heard inklings. Okay. Bitch. That was a funny joke. Mm hmm. Uh huh. <laughs> what is Sonic it? or normal? Brain surgery. Normal. Well, yeah, it's not rocket science. I hope you know that I didn't pay attention to their names or what they do, so I just called them Evil Lady and Evil Guy. <laughs> How do you know they're evil? Oh, I'm sorry. Did you not see their evil files? Oh, that's right. Top secret evil files. Oh, no. I forgot she says that. Uh huh. His name? Derek. Mm hmm. Mm-hmm. No, I, I don't think it is. It doesn't say private and confidential. Mm-hmm. Yeah, no shit.
Mm-hmm. Yeah. Is he about to break out into song? I'm starting to think he might be a scientist because of the hair and the round glasses. Not and the also, bow tie? Also the bow tie. Yeah. Ah. I'm still alive. Okay, that's actually making it hard to concentrate because those aren't words. <laughs> Hello, British man. Hello, yes, enemy of humanity. Oh, oh. I must destroy you, British Colonel Sanders. Your fried chicken will make you far will give too me many people obese in the coming years. Your chicken will make a fine addition to my collection. Many riots will be started over the sandwiches. I will steal the 11 secret herbs and spices. I will now go to Popeye's and give it to them. Mm hmm. <sighs> mm hmm. So a cult. The cat. Mm hmm. Uh-huh. Hello. Pizza. Hello. I am knockoff Albert Einstein. I am Austrian. Obviously, because I'm a scientist. Duh. I, I'm, I'm gay. Mm-hmm.
Uh huh. Feminism. We don't like women. Yes. Can't you tell they're serious? Uh huh. So, Facebook. <laughs> uh huh. What? Oh. Top of the modern to you. <laughs> Why doesn't he blink? That's why, because you're sinking. <laughs> okay. Mm hmm. Time for your threesome, Professor Kettlewell. Uh, there were four people there. Oh, that's right, there were four. Sorry, orgy. Oh, they forgot to oh, it's use- Bessie! Oh, they don't want to use the other car anymore. No, that was John Pertwee's, remember? Yes, I know. Benton got promoted. Mm-hmm. No, 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 that's not why I'm laughing. I'm laughing because I saw a bad pun. 
Oh no. What's the pun? Oh, for fuck's sake, dear Worcestershire. <laughs> really? I mean, it's because you pronounce it Worcestershire, but it's fine. No, I get the pun, and I think it's funny. I'm just... Really? Yeah. Really? Yeah. That's the pun that makes you laugh? Yeah. It was the best of times. It was the worst... It was the best shire. It was the worst of shire. <laughs> yes. <gasps> did you see the private notes? Because I sure fucking did. How did you know they were private? Oh my god, it said so. Of course. I hope you know Max is high as dicks, and I'm sending this to him, and I hope he laughs until he can't fucking take it anymore. Good work. Good luck with that. Oh, there goes that idea. Hi. What's up? <laughs> <laughs> Don't just walk away! <laughs> God damn. He fell for it. <sighs> uh huh. Man, I love a Doctor Who episode that has a whole lot of nothing going on. You miss an incredibly action <laughs> Don't come back in here laughing! And I wanted to specifically text it to you. Yes! It was the best of Shires, it was the worst of Shires. Okay, well come here. If that's not what you were fucking laughing at. No, you just threw it back. That's what I sent you. Or Chestershire. <laughs> Go in the other room. War chest. You don't deserve to be on this podcast. Don't. When you go to bed, I love you. He wasn't even fucking laughing at the thing I sent him. Can we have Max on the one where we're gonna do drugs? Hell yeah, we can. <laughs> but he's the only one who's not high off, he's not. No, he needs to be. He's hilarious when he is. Yes, I remember. I remember specifically the image of us being high off our nut and me looking over my shoulder at the sink to see if Max is okay. And me asking, Max, are you okay? And Max looks up with a, a shit ton of cake in his mouth because he's been shoveling it in his mouth with both his hands and he just goes rrr, rrr. and then we all start pissing ourselves laughing <laughs> yep that was a thing it still remains to be the funniest fucking thing I ever remember <laughs> from that time anyway hitting play on part 3 now and I'll tell you when the episode starts it's gonna start now I am really sorry if anyone is trying to watch along with this. I am trying so hard to sync these up for you. <laughs> Don't even try it, buddy. You cannot be on the desk right now. <laughs> there is too much on my desk. I love you, but please no. Don't. Please don't.
What do you see, buddy? Professor? <sighs> See, you missed it last time, so now you can watch it here. Oh. Hello, buddy. Which part? The, the private notes? No, the fight. The entire fight. You're preoccupied by your high husband. Hmm. There they are. Private notes. I wonder what these private notes say. Shh, it's a secret. Shh, it's a secret to everyone. No, that's what it says inside. Shh, it's a secret. Oh. No, that doesn't work. <laughs> Lord knows why he thought it would. <laughs> he fell for it. <laughs> Also, they, they cut down the fight in the replay, thankfully. Yeah. But again, the fight is a holdover from the old series, people. It's, it's made better by, like, the little eccentric nature of Tom Baker and his doctor, but, like, it's still, like, a, okay, I get it. I get it. Come mm -hmm. on. Which is very much a holdover of uh, Barry Letts and Terrence Dicks. This is the absolute final episode. Hmm. That sentence made no sense. Act wrongly. What do you mean, woman? Uh huh. Pew, 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 mm -hmm. Bang, bang, boom, boom. Oh, Benton, don't hold your gun there. Don't hold your, don't hold your gun right there. And that's the second time mm -hmm. someone's been tied up into a cabinet in this episode. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. 
Now I have a wound on the back of my head so we don't have to show it. Mm -hmm. uh, Professor, I handed you an empty cup to make your own tea with. Uh -huh. Professor, you're you're mentally stable right now, right? The goods. No. <gasps> Blanco! That's your town! Uh-huh. She's telling him... You're, you're gonna get a visit from Benton. Oh, boy. Can you get him... Can, can I have his autograph? Sure. Ah, like that's ever stopped the British government. Uh huh. Oh yeah, sure it would be. Uh huh. <laughs> and that I fucking love that line so much. <laughs> it points out to its own stupidity of the concept of Great Britain being treated as a neutral party. Hmm. I'm sure that'll go over well. <laughs> Really? You're looking at- I just look down and fucking Ridge is staring up at me with the most disjointed, pissed off face. Even he Good. hated that pun. Good. Oh!
And now here's our musical guest, Sir Paul McCartney. <laughs> Gam, I think they might be fascists. What? Why? What gives you that idea? They fucking have armbands. How have I not noticed that? <laughs> Why do they oh, have dear fucking God. armbands? It's the fascists. I get it, but like, come on. Oh. Uh. There's those concepts being brought up again. Eco-fascism and ends justifying the means. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I've never noticed that! <laughs> the gunshot, he just falls down. <laughs> Oh, God. I mean, how else will you pretend to be shot? Bang, bang, a boom. Rot row. Mm -hmm. Nice mobile, nerd.
you forgot him to about him too, didn't you? No. I do like a hostage. I like a good blood hostage. I like him big. I like him chunky. <laughs> uh huh. Chunky. Mm -hmm. I wonder what that big 300 in the back is going to be. Wow, it's so like a fascist to hide in a bunker. Uh, the 300 in the background is actually a work in print uh, version of Zack Snyder's movie 300. Mm. Oh, pay me like one of your French brigadiers. We don't have any friends. There are hundreds of us. Seriously, there's like 205. You are my prisoner. Whatever. Oh, those people are dead. <laughs> I mean, the thing is, though, is they're probably not human, so... Hello, buddy. Jesus Christ, this third episode is going on forever. It's nearly over, don't worry.
I do like firing missiles. Oh, whiskey. Mm -hmm. Oh, wait, no. It's not a bottle of it's whiskey. It's a bottle opener. Oh, oh wait. it's his penis. <laughs> it's either a bottle opener or a giant car key. Like a fucking or Riku a giant key blade cock. bullshit. Oh, okay. Uh, looks like it's the keyblade. He's gonna go open the door to darkness. Say, fellas. Did somebody <laughs> say the door to darkness? Run away! <laughs> Run away! Run away from the man in a very obvious suit. I will say, as far as robot designs go, it's miles better than very obvious jumpsuit. Mm -hmm. I'd much rather, like, clunky cylinders trying to hide the outline of a man rather than, I'm you know, just a man in a jumpsuit. Is that a... That's a real tank. Definitely not a toy tank. <laughs> oh, well, there goes the tank. Oh, little Tommy's gonna be so sad. <laughs> Imagine him watching it, being like, Oh, Daddy, is that my tank? And the director's just like, Yes, son, it is. And then Tommy's right. like, wow, daddy, my tank's on the television. My tank's daddy, in Doctor Daddy, where did my Who? tank go? Daddy. Daddy, where did my tank go? It's gone up to the farm up north, son. It's gone up to tank heaven. <laughs> it's gone to frolic with all the other tanks up north. Bum ba bum bum ba bum bum ba bum 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 Imagine if this was six episodes long. I would hate it so much. Hitting play on part four now. And the episode has started playing. Now! Yay! Skippy doo boop. Schlimbity boom. Springy dork. I love the- can I just say, I really love the adorableness of the shot where the tank is. Because it's not CSO, it's literally like they've set the camera up far away mm -hmm. and then they've like put some dirt up there to make it look like the road. Oh yeah. And it's- it's such they, a great perspective just, shot, it's adorable. Just, it's and you can see the string! In Blu-ray quality you can see the string pulling the tank along! I love it. It's field of view, but yes. Yeah, field of view, sorry. Um, it's, it's a field of view, uh, manipulating perspective, yes. but I, I, I love that in Blu-ray quality, you can see the string in DVD. You could barely see it, but in Blu-ray, it's like, yep, that's a, that's, that's a string pulling the tank along.
uh, the missiles. Then, well, then I'll take a nap. Then fire the missiles. Hmm. Okay. Oh my god, dear, it's counting down. Yeah. Kill them. Mm -hmm. Kill her. Trying is half the battle. Wait. Cunt? Oh. I thought he was calling them a cunt. <gasps> the doors. Oh, wait, you're not the doors, you're Sarah. Don't we all? I mean, every day. Wait, hang on. No, I don't. I mean, I kind of do with the fucking in my hometown and at the gym sometimes because people are being jackasses, but. That's just shitty white people. <laughs> What is God to a non-believer? God is dead. Nish was right. I've already sent the tweet.
Oh no, I've hit the button for it to go again. No, it's like, you did it. You stopped the, you stopped the missiles going out. It's like, no, I just stopped the countdown. The missiles are still gone. I just, I was getting sick of the beeping. <laughs> we're, we're all going to die. Oh, a good indie game. Hmm. Kindness. As a British man and a military man, I don't like that. Not at all. Oh, okay. Go about your business then. Bunger? Bunger. Bunger! Do they get along better? Um... A little bit. The fourth Doctor is a little bit more... He's a little bit better at social manipulation. Like, he fundamentally disagrees with the Brigadier, but, like, he knows that in order to get the Brigadier to do what the Doctor wants, he basically needs to pretend, like... He's obeying the Brigadier, if that makes sense. Mm. Sort of like, he still feels the same way, but he knows that if he just says, Brigadier, don't shoot the thing, Brigadier will go, no, I'll shoot the thing. The Fourth Doctor, I'll, I'll talk about it in the discussion, but they, they wanted him, he specifically wanted to, a Doctor to be more detached in, in a sort of way. Um, more emotionally and sort of that sort of attached to certain... That doesn't mean he has no morals or anything. It just means he uh, is more aloof and uh, erratic with his personality. He doesn't get, like, offended or childish like uh, John Pertwee did as the Doctor. When he does act childish, it's because he's in control and he has the sort of demeanour of, like, Acting so confident, even if a gun's pointed at him, that like it puts people off. I love how. Also, the do you think those fire buckets? <laughs> <laughs> I was about to say, do you think those I love... buckets have fire in them? I was about to say, I love how their fucking way to deal with fire is a bucket. Not even a bucket near like a faucet, just a bucket. Hey, buckets are important. Also, the bucket does say fire on it, so that, considering all the other naming conventions, that leads me to believe that uh, there's fire in that bucket, not uh, water. So, I'm confused. Or did they do that on purpose in order to confuse people? Machines like hips do not lie. Oh, look, they put soap in that one. (laughs) 
Uh, mm, I don't think, mm. The robot wanted to fuck cattle well! Oh. I would just dis not disagree. Dear, are you an eco fascist? Uh, that's not the part that I'm agreeing with, but. By some people's standards, probably. Come on, man, come on, come on. Oh, hey, they put soap in that one, too. And an Alka Seltzer in that one. Ooh, they've got some tang. Tang in that one with some soap. Mm hmm. Okay. You know I don't pull out Benton. Mm hmm. Look at that fucking dick. Uh oh. Is this Power Rangers? Uh oh. Now it's turning into Godzilla. Is this just Power Rangers? Godzilla? No, Power Rangers. Boba Fett. Power Rangers! Go, go, Power Rangers! Yes, that one. Actually, it's not Power Rangers, it's something else. Um, oh, that's right, King Kong. Mm hmm. That's sure some green screening. <laughs> did they just put a doll in his hand? Yeah, they did. Yep. Yeah, they did. It's so apparent on the Blu ray, and I love it. I love it so much. Uh. Run away!
Oh. I saw his arm poke out, but I guess we're not going to talk about that. <laughs> pew 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 pew. Is the PhD doctor going to be a companion now? Bessie! Uh, okay. Oh, it's Nickelodeon Gak, but red. That's, that's just soap. I'll have you know, it's a scientific formula. Oh my god, it got green screened out when he drove towards it. Oh no, it's becoming hot and spicy. It's being covered in zinger tasting. Zinger tasting? It's turning into a KFC double down, dear. It's becoming Mountain Dew Code Red? Oh, no. Don't turn me into a Cheeto! So why did the... In disintegration ray make it bigger? Because it, it was a massive infusion of energy, and remember the metal that it's made out of is supposedly living metal that can grow when it's infused, essentially receives massive amounts of en electrical or energy charges. Uh -huh. So instead of disintegrating it, it used the energy to grow. The bullshit, it's gotcha. Bullshit that's left over from the old crew, remember? Oh my god, there was a man in there all along. That's called PTSD. She's just traumatized. <laughs> yeah, it's fine. She's just traumatized. I wanted to fuck that robot. There it is. Uh huh. And Great Britain.
Mm-hmm. Now that's a quote that people still say to this day, and I agree with. Is he actually coming? Is he actually coming? <laughs> no, he's talking to them, dear. He's not coming. Are you fucking kidding me? Oh, I say, oh my. I'm so mad. Don't worry, I'm not the biggest fan of Harry Sullivan either. I don't even remember what I said jokingly. I know, it was really funny, but it's okay. You don't have to laugh that bad. <laughs> I wish I was laughing. <sighs> I hope you know that me saying that I was angry for you at you earlier on Twitter is now doubled but it's not even because it's your fault it's completely out of your control but i'm still mad at you specifically yeah 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 uh, that's okay 